what did you make of it now have you calmed down she has to go I'm from not, the I'm... campaign to the country but tell us honestly what you thought well so uh, you said earlier that i'm not left or right i'm actually i know that there's been criticism in the uh, the mail on sunday today about lefty liberal wokey comedians on the bbc i'm actually very right wing and i loved it i thought she was very clear she gave great clear answers i know exactly what she's up to and I think she's. Uh, most people watching at home who are worried about their bills there's are going to feel. There's a serious point, Joe. Forgive me. There's a I'm serious point. I'm not being sarcastic. She said that there was a big package of help coming this week yeah. for people to help she pay their bills. was very clear what she said, and I, I, I'm, I think. You know exactly what's going to happen. I think you're reassured. I'm reassured. Are you reassured? Well, Emily Thornberry, so reassured. you're smirking over there. Politics the can be very, very unpredictable. I mean, mm. let's look at two different opinions in the papers this yes. morning. You have a columnist, um, Matthew Syed, who's basically predicting that it's going to be a nightmare and that the leadership contest has been out of touch with the country. But Janet Daly in The Telegraph says, look, actually, Liz Truss is stronger than you think. If she gets cracking, yeah. gets out there, she might be Fair able to... to... Janet. I think, you know, the haters will say that You've had 12 years of the Tories and that we're sort of at the dregs of what they've got available and that Liz Truss is sort of like the backwash of the available MPs. I wouldn't say that because I'm incredibly right wing, but some people might say that. But the consensus, though, in politics is often wrong, right? Yeah. I mean, it's often it's often wrong and we often don't know what is going to pan out. Yeah. Well, as, as Liz said there, she said she would be wrong to predict the future, even though loads of people have predicted that we're going to have real issues with paying our energy bills. But, um, you know, I think she's right to just then just sort of basically say, well, let's not predict and see what happens next week. Okay. I think she did the right thing there. Well, let's talk about something completely